So today we're going to have a look at the Edmonton International Airport. Edmonton is a city of around 1.2 million people. And Alberta has a population of around 4 million people. The Edmonton International Airport is located to the south of the city. It has two runways, large car park in the centre, multi-storey car park, and then the passenger terminal building which wraps around, and all the gates for the aircraft parking. You can see a plane about to take off over there. There is cargo facilities or cargo planes. And heading north from the Edmonton International Airport is the Queen Elizabeth Highway. This is the Queen Elizabeth Highway and the city is to the north in that direction. So we're just going to jump over to my plane. And we can see the Edmonton International Airport over there, Queen Elizabeth Highway. And if we spin around, we can see down below here the IKEA building for Edmonton. IKEA Edmonton. Not far from IKEA Edmonton is a cinema complex in that building there. And all the way around Edmonton is a highway which does a complete loop around the city, we can see here. And it rings the entire city. And you can do laps of the city using that highway. As we head north towards the city, we can see Edmonton in the distance. Edmonton per capita has the highest amount of parkland of any Canadian city. The parkland on the river is 22 times the size of Central Park in New York City. The North Saskatchewan River flows past the city of Edmonton. And just to the south of the city here, we can see Alberta University. That is Alberta University for there. To the north of the city, we have the Edmonton City Centre. And near the Edmonton City Centre is the City Hall. So we can point out the City Hall and exactly where the Edmonton City Centre is located, just here near the water feature is the Edmonton City Hall. To the south of that is the Sir Winston Churchill Square. And just in the corner of the screen, here is the Edmonton Art Gallery. Now across the road is the Edmonton City Centre, which includes a lot of parkland. Down here, right below, is the Louise McKinney Riverfront Park. Over here, in this location, is called Roger Place. And to the north of the city here, is the Commonwealth Center. As we go further north, we can see the Edmonton Expo Center. And just across the road from the Edmonton 
Expo Center is the Hockey Center, the Northland Hockey Coliseum. There is this airport just located to the north of the city called the Edmonton Municipal Airport. Near that is Kingsway Shopping Centre. And next to that is the Alexandria Hospital, located there. Alexandria Hospital, Kingsway Shopping Centre, and even further north in the distance, we can see another airport, and that is for military purposes. Now, just to the south east of the city is Bonnie Doon. This is Bonnie Doon Shopping Centre. Edmonton has quite a few shopping centres, one to the north, one to the south, one to the east and one to the west. This is the Bonnie Doon Shopping Centre. This is 82nd Avenue. We follow 82nd Avenue. It leads into the Sherwood Park Freeway. On either side of the Sherwood Park Freeway is a business park. And on the other side is Mills Industrial Park. We'll fly in this direction towards Sherwood Park. The first suburb we come across is Sherwood Heights. Then we have Brentwood. And in the far distance, we can see Fox Haven. Now, just located here is the Sherwood Park Shopping Center. And this whole area here around the Sherwood Park Shopping Centre. In the very far distance, we can see a Boag Lake, B-O-A-G Lake. Now the Sherwood Park Shopping Centre is located here. We get to this intersection, go down the road, turn right, and we've got Costco Shopping Centre, where there is further shopping. We'll just loop around and we'll head back towards the city. And we'll get another look at the Louise McKinney Riverfront Park. In the very far distance in that direction is Jasper. I understand it is around 40 minutes away by helicopter. This is the North Saskatchewan River. That flows past Edmonton. And just down there is the Louise McKinney Riverfront Park. And as we head back over the Alberta University, we are heading towards West Edmonton. Now there's two shopping centres ahead. The first shopping centre that we can see in the far distance is called Meadow Lark Shopping Centre. I 
can see all that parkland. Down here is a pedestrian bridge. And in the far distance is the Meadow Lark Shopping Centre. And then in the further distance, we can see the West Edmonton Shopping Centre. Meadow Lark. And then the West Edmonton Shopping Centre is located there. So over there is the city. And in this direction from the city is the West Edmonton Shopping Centre. The West Edmonton Shopping Centre has a cinema complex. And it also has the World Water Park. So we'll jump in a helicopter. And we'll go and have a look at Jasper, which is located out in that direction. We continue to see the freeway, which goes all the way around the city on this side. But for now, we will jump in the helicopter. So over there is Jasper. If you head south of Jasper, you have this road. And it is called the Icefields Parkway or the Promenade des Glaciers. The Icefields Parkway heads in this direction. And turning right off the Icefields Parkway is Marmot Road. Now up Marmot Road is a location that is not on any maps and none of the locals will tell you about. It also has no signposting. There's Promenade des Glaciers or the Icefields Parkway. Off there is Marmot Road. And off Marmot Road is this winding track going up. Now if we follow Marmot Road around, it leads to Marmot Basin. In Marmot Basin, is located up there. Now just on the corner here, a little way from Marmot Basin and a little way up the road from the winding pathway, just on this corner is another pathway which has no sign posting, none of the locals will tell you about and is not on any maps. but if you follow that pathway all the way down towards the end, there is a location called the Edge of the World. And the Edge of the World looks out in this direction towards Jasper. So there's Jasper. South of Jasper is the Icefields Parkway or Promenade des Glaciers. You take a right, take another right onto Marmot Road, follow Marmot Road around, past the winding pathway, which leads up the mountain. Just on this corner is a small pathway leading to the edge, and that there is called the edge of the world. Now this is quite a mountainous region.
but the edge of the world is not in the highest location, but it is on the edge of a small cliff. Looking out towards Jasper and just on this corner here, very close to the Marmot Basin. And that is the edge of the world.